Unlike most of the past recent years here, the state is sitting on a lot of money, which should set up a big political fight between Democrats and Republicans over how to spend it. But it is an old issue that could be sparking a major political brawl this year. With just over a week until lawmakers return to the state legislature, another battle brewing over abortion. Democrats are pushing to repeal a decades-old law that remains on the books, one that criminalizes abortions should Roe versus Wade get overturned. Overnight, Arizona can become El Salvador, where poor women with miscarriages are getting thrown in prison because they're mistaken for having abortions. Democratic House Minority Whip Athena Salmon. I think it's very urgent for the legislature to, at the very least, repeal our laws that criminalize women and their doctors. That's something that would be considered by Republicans. Absolutely not. Despite the sharp differences, Republican Speaker Pro Tem T.J. Show predicts a quick end of the session because lawmakers will be eager to get out and campaign. Let's start off with when the session's going to end and maybe we could ask uh, what some people are smoking here. The dean of the Capitol Press Corps, Howard Fisher, predicting a long and brutal session. The state will be flush with cash, leading to major fights over how to spend it. There's high demand to improve the state's roads and highways, especially in rural Arizona, and to put more money into public safety and shore up security at state prisons, as well as phase in the final installment of the 20 percent pay raise lawmakers had promised teachers back in 2018. This will be the year that we go ahead and do year three, and we're already talking about uh, what uh, the future holds as far as education funding mm -hmm. uh, for our teachers in the state. And there could be a big fight down here this year over recreational marijuana. The question for lawmakers is, do they want to craft legislation that would legalize it or leave it up to the voters in a likely citizens initiative that should be on the ballot in November? At the state capitol, Dennis Welch, Arizona's Family.